What's up, you guys? We're at Escape Room CT. Now, you know in these situations, Taylor gets a little frightened. Excuse so you. we have some help to uh, help us find our way through this That's right. Uh, we room. are teaming up with Escape the Rumors to tackle this okay. asylum. Guys, any advice? Um, just communicate survive. with each other. So survive. She says survive. Like, that's we're not going to make about. it out. But that, that's also important. I mean, yes. <laughs> right. Definitely communicate, teamwork. You find something, say it out loud so everyone knows. Um, Book it out. Yeah, you guys are going to do fine. I hope so. Yeah, we'll let one you brain, one. <laughs> one team. Everybody hands in. Hey, Let's hands go. In. Asylum on three. One, one two, three. three. Asylum. <laughs> So we opened last October, and before this, I actually was a police officer, and I wanted to actually kind of open up something that was very positive and exciting. So I kind of got hooked on escape rooms a few years ago, and this, this is how it was created. Like, I what? think I like the idea of figuring things out, and then uh, like basically figuring them out, and then coming to a conclusion in the end. Um, escape rooms are a lot of fun. So. You know, if you've ever done an escape room before, you know that you figure out puzzles and that puzzle leads you to the next puzzle until you get to the end and it's just very gratifying. You begin the game and you, you get like emerged into another reality. So that's why we really love it because it kind of takes you from your, out of your day to day and brings you to an, a whole new world. We actually started this just like a year ago and uh, we've been a little bit crazy over this year. We've done over, I think 350 rooms and uh, over five continents now on just escape room um, tours and locations. And then we're doing uh, the background uh, stories on the escape room owners and the inspiration stories of why they're creating the rooms, we find that really fascinating for the uh, uh, enthusiasts out there because we think like, hey, you know, you guys come do a room in 60 minutes, but like, do you know how much time it takes to build and create these rooms? Um, and we just think that it's really important to tell a story. Yeah, I mean, we started this off as like just a hobby for things to do because, you know, being a married couple, there's a like, some friends will want to go clubbing and want to do this and we're not really into that so we're like board game people and then our friends kept trying to get us to try escape rooms and we're like really we're gonna pay money to lock us in to try to escape but then the first time we did it we actually didn't get out the first time which i think kind of like sparked something because like oh no i gotta go back i gotta try something else and then it just became a thing where we, you know in our nature we're born to network so we talk with the owners we talk with people and we're always fascinated by their story Welcome to the asylum at Fairfield Hills. Uh, recently, six paranormal investigators have gone missing. This asylum is said to be haunted by the patients that once lived here. Dr. Borden, who used to work at the asylum, performed inhumane experiments on these patients, which led to many of their deaths. You guys are a group of detectives that are called in to investigate the disappearance of these paranormal investigators, and you're convinced that Dr. Borden is behind it. He has just left this facility, and you guys are now going to be entering through a secret tunnel system into the asylum. Your mission is to, in 60 minutes or less, collect all the evidence that is needed to convict Dr. Borden and bring him to justice before he returns. Here we go. All right. After you. Okay, first one that goes in usually dies. So. Oh, great, okay. <laughs> oh, Bye. Right. Bye. Oh, oh this is guys. creepy as heck. Yeah. Yeah. Reach around. Oh, reach around. Oh. Okay, there we go. What is that? It looks like a magnet. Right. It all depends on Jimmy. <laughs> I know. We're gonna die in here. Oh man, come on, Fifth. <laughs> Sounds like he's getting it. Oh, he got. Oh, 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 oh he got. Let's go! Hey! Hey! Jimmy! Hey! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! There are 52 minutes remaining oh, right. in right. the game. 52. Please press oh, enter. Oh, okay. press enter after inputting code. So, okay. Ooh. Yes. Oh. Awesome. Great activity. This is hard. Heart. Let's go. Hey. Hey. Dang it. How do you? Oh, we're so close though. That's that bad. Might, that might not be good. <laughs> we're still in here. Oh, now we gotta get out of here. We're walking through body parts <laughs> into. I'm just gonna put it. Into body parts. Look at this. We have to remember that, right? Bro, with the Nike shocks, you could have ran faster, man. Oh, wow. All the way back at the very beginning? Really? Yeah, I guess so. Y'all know I don't do these well. You win? Congratulations. Yeah!